Hello, Les from Thailand and today's video is going to be an informative video as about what my future videos are going to be within the next week or two weeks. As we're in lockdown now, there's time to do many videos and some of the subjects I'm going to cover shortly, this is what I'm going to be doing over the next one or two weeks. I hope that you find the videos interesting as to what I can do and what you can do whilst in lockdown. This COVID situation is going to be with us for a a while I think so therefore we are going to be restricted in our movements around Thailand so for instance I did my video on Covid and that was on the 27th of December and at that time there was 85 cases confirmed in the Rayong district and today which is the 5th of January 2021 there are 456 cases so in a nine day period it has grown by 371 and I'm sure it's still going to grow even further. Um, the Thai government are trying to keep a lid on it and try to suppress it and uh, fingers crossed they, would, they will do it. But I understand that the Thai government have ordered a few million vaccines from both India and China but let's see what happens. They are going to develop the AstraZeneca from England under license here in Thailand, but they say that's not going to be available until early May, maybe it's July time. So it's going to be a while before the vaccine's here. So there's going to be a lot of scared people about. So my advice is take care, stay at home, do things at home, do things that you maybe haven't done for a, a long time and it gives you the time to do it. So the videos I'm going to produce in the next two weeks or so is You'll see some pictures here, my net house. Now this this is a small greenhouse and net house, it's not covered in plastic, it's just a, a breathable net finish. I've, I've planted my vegetables and tomatoes and peppers and, and lettuces today. So we'll just see how that goes on. Uh, I'll go briefly through the construction of the net house, how much it cost me and the type of things that you can grow in there. I did have a hydroponic setup, but that failed unfortunately. Um, due to the, the poor plastic on the greenhouse that just failed and let all the water in and it just killed everything that was in there and it became a bit of a mosquito heaven. So I, I sold it, I got knocked it down, sold it and said oh, I'll just leave that alone now. So now I've got my little net house so that's where I've started back up because of this Covid situation. And one of the other subjects I'm going to be doing is the solar lights. The solar light and the panels, payback time and what you can use them for. They're not just for security. They are 65 watt LED lights and I've just ordered another three of them and I'm going to be using them for decorative purposes and ambience setting. So I'll go through a video with that and you'll be surprised as the payback time for these lights. These lights are a very, very quick retain period and I think you'll be happy with the results of what you can do with them. And I've also ordered a big 340 watt solar panel and grid tie inverter. Um, now again, I've watched many YouTube videos and as I was an electrician in England, solar's always interested me, but the return period is far, far too long. But I've since seen a way where you can, the return period on the money that you invest is returnable within a couple of years. So watch my video on the solar system that I'm going to be setting up at my house. Um, if, if it didn't give a, a quick return, then I would never have done it in the first place. But that would be an interesting video because it's it's easily doable. Any, any DIY person can do it over here in Thailand and that's a, a good return also. The other subject I'm going to be covering, again, because I was an electrician in the UK, and jokingly, I used to say to people, oh, Wi-Fi electric isn't available yet because they're asking me for a switch here and a switch there and a switch there. And I said, it's not so much the problem of putting the switch there, it's putting the cables there. And these can be difficult situations with the concrete walls here in Thailand to put two-way switch in. Um, but now there's a solution. There is a Wi-Fi lighting solution to it. And you can buy the light switches and the various bits and pieces that come with it to make it into a, a Wi-Fi light switch. So you're gonna have up to four or five switches turning one light on. And I'm gonna go through that in, a, in another video. That's very, very interesting. I joked about it, but now apparently it's, it's available. You can get it. 
and it's quite easy to do it's not very difficult also and the other thing that I'm going to mention is how to get a home cinema system for less than 10,000 baht which is just over a couple of hundred pounds and it's acceptable I, I've had this system in now for a couple of years and I've got a, a projector mounted on the wall and a 100 inch screen which is an electric screen so it folds up by a press of a button and it comes down by a press of a button and it's quite a, a good system I'm very very happy with it the results that you get off it is brilliant and I'll go through the system and how much it costs and again for 200 pounds or so it's a very very affordable system and it gives really really good quality uh, results for not a lot of money again i was shocked and surprised at the quality that i got from this machine and i'll pass it on to you and you can go and build your own home cinema system it does give you the cinema feel because if it's it's a hundred inch picture and it's i like it it's fantastic and the next subject i'm going to discuss as well is and um, the last time we had a lockdown i went on the keto diet and I lost 18 kilograms on the keto diet. That's because we never went out to restaurants and things like that. And I could control where I, where I eat. And now it looks like we're in lockdown again. So I'm going to do the keto diet again. Um, like I said, I lost 18 kilograms. I put five kilograms back on over a six month period. So again, I want to go back on the keto. A fantastic, easy diet to follow and once you're into it you don't feel hungry at all it's a fant it's probably one of the easiest best diets i've ever been on so my plan is to lose another 10 kilos whilst in this lockdown period so i'm going to do a video on my weight loss results as from day one so just follow it i'll put a so a weekly video on as to how much i've lost and what i've been eating and how you can do it might as well do something in this lockdown period so there's a list of suggestions there. I hope you'd be interested in most of them, if not all of them. And if you like the idea, please leave your comments down below. If you like the channel, give it a thumbs up. Maybe subscribe, that'd be nice. That'd help my channel along. And we'll just go from there. So from Les, living the dream in Thailand. Until the next time, bye for now.